Hey guys, welcome back to World of Mechanics. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. In today's video, we'll be working on a Volkswagen Tiguan, guys, and we will show you where your coolant level sensor is located. Let's say, guys, you have enough coolant in your car, but you get that annoying message inside on the dash that says at coolant or coolant level is low. Stay with us, we'll explain where that sensor is located. Now, quick introduction to the channel, guys. Every single car we get at the shop, we make at least 200 free videos, guys. On that Tiguan alone, we will have more than three to 400 free repair videos on our channels, guys. And why we do all that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, guys, so we can keep providing these videos. Now, if you guys need to buy a new sensor, okay, uh, replacement parts for your car tools, check out the link in the description of the video below. We share it for your convenience, guys. I will go ahead, open the hood, support it, and show you where it's located. It doesn't matter, guys, which engine you have. It doesn't matter if you have a gasoline, diesel engine in Europe, the procedure is practically the same. This is a 2014 Volkswagen t1 and it should work for the whole first generation from year 2007 to year 2017 guys okay the whole generation now before we continue guys we'll be taking the whole car apart everything engine suspension interior guys we'll show you how to fix anything and all these videos will be published on our main channel how to repair guys World Mechanics, what you're watching now, it's more of an informational channel. We teach you where sensors are located, how your car functions and things like that. And if you guys want to see diagnostic videos, uh, diagnostics of engine light, airbag light, where uh, fuses and relays are located, you can find it on Electrical Car Repair Live. That's where those videos will be published. So once you guys open, okay, the hood of your Volkswagen T1, what you're going to find out on the left side, this is your coolant overflow bottle, guys. This is your coolant overflow bottle. And you can see how you can see the um, uh, level of the coolant when it's cold, minimum and maximum. Ours is just above the maximum, right on spot. But if you guys get a message on the inside, okay, that you need to add coolant or coolant level is low, this is because the system is not correctly reading that you have enough coolant. Never ever open the coolant when the engine is hot or after driving the car, guys. Open it uh, only in the mornings, okay if the car wasn't driven for a whole night let it sit overnight and then open it guys and okay this is the coolant cap. okay right here so i'll go ahead i want to remove it quick guys okay so i can show you something okay perfect and this is orange guys but if you can see there is two wires going inside and this is guys the sensor right here this is the sensor okay and uh, the wires are inside and it's measuring the fuel at uh, the uh, coolant level guys you can see them i cannot show you with the camera very clearly but you can see two metal rods going in and it's detecting if you have coolant or not if they get dry what will happen if you're below the minimum it's going to detect it and it will tell you that you need to add coolant but sometimes it fails guys always check your connection here make sure that everything's good uh, how you open it okay simply press that thing back and then pull it out make sure that everything is uh, is good and reinsert it make sure you don't have any corrosion if that doesn't fix the problem okay you will have to replace the sensor which most of the times it's integrated in the bottle uh, coolant overflow bottle and you will need to replace the whole bottle now if you want to see that video guys okay the replacement video of the coolant overflow bottle that will be shared on our main channel how to repair guys so please check it out thank you for watching guys and see you guys next time